I'm gonna be telling you how you can start a drop shipping business with zero dollars or if anything at all, a maximum of $30. Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of you that don't know, my name is Austin Raven and I cover everything from e-commerce, drop shipping, Shopify, Facebook advertising, general business tips, finance, and much more. So I'm pretty excited to make this video. Now I'm gonna be covering the strategy that I would use and have used in the past. I have found success with this. I'll link the video up here. I wanted to make a more detailed video on the exact business plan that I did and how it can make you successful in drop shipping as well. Let's start off with the basics here. You're gonna open up a Shopify account. You're probably already thinking, Austin, of course, after the 14 day free trial, Shopify costs $30 a month. Yes, that's the only time that you're gonna have to spend this money, but you can avoid paying this fee with a credit card or something like that if you really want to. Uh, everyone knows that this fee is coming, so you're gonna have to deal with it. It's 30 bucks. Get one paycheck, split in two, split in two deal with it so up on the right we're gonna go to start a free trial and then I'll basically you're just gonna put in your email your password the store name and keep in mind that the store name doesn't actually have to be the URL or domain name that you choose for your website after you make your Shopify account you're obviously going to build your entire Shopify store okay my oh. camera's battery died so hopefully this is the same angle but I'm not gonna be covering how to build the entire store in this video I do have a video if you're interested in this in the link below after you complete your full Shopify store build you're gonna to want to build a Instagram business account as well as a TikTok business account the Instagram account you really just need to have your username post at least nine photos of your product or a theme around your product. Say it's gym shorts, um, just people lifting weights and at the gym and exercising, that'll, that'll do is fine just make sure that your instagram page looks like a real brand and people would trust it step two is going to be finding the niche that you want to sell in and then the product so there's a ton of different niches out there and a lot of really good niches and niches that are popular right now and taking off so there are a lot of options to choose from and the thing is pretty much every niche is going to be selling right like people in america just buy so much stuff you can't really go wrong with your niche to be honest as long as you market it correctly to the correct people you should be good to go for this type of store if you're running with like organic traffic and you're not trying to spend any money on advertising you want a product that's pretty engaging so something that you can demonstrate or a product that you can show has a clear function and purpose that will keep the viewers attention for longer than three seconds mr zuckerberg do i have your full attention no a great example of this would be like that supreme money gun i'm sure people have seen it where basically you just load up the fake gun with money and it shoots money out right that's like an eye-catching product then once you find the product you're going to want to go to aliexpress and source that product you can use other sites i'm just using aliexpress as an example but you want to make sure to go when you're on aliexpress contact that supplier and make sure that they have the product in stock and then they can ship it as fast as you want them to ship it. People on AliExpress can ship items within a week. It's a common misconception that they all ship for like 60 days out or like they're stuck on these boats out in the middle of the sea and stuff like that. Like that's not necessarily true. AliExpress does have some good suppliers. So you can find them as long as you communicate with them. Make sure you guys are clear on what you're expecting and what you're gonna get when you purchase it. And if you don't wanna order product and you're like, oh, Austin, I, you said $0, I can't order the product because it's six bucks or whatever. Okay, that's fine. Use a product that you already have at your house. So any small item that you've bought online in the last year that you think would sell well because you bought it yourself, use that product then. That's fine. But it's important that you order the product yourself. The first reason is you wanna test the quality of the product. You don't wanna have a bunch of returns and people getting broken products. That's just a headache. Uh, so order the product yourself, test it, and then the second biggest reason to do this is because you wanna create the content yourself. It's extremely important for organic marketing to have the content yourself and have the ability to produce a mass amount of content quickly. And you can't do that by paying for people to make ads for you or paying influencers to do certain things for you or post it for you and you don't need any fancy camera all you need is really an iphone any android phone will do uh it doesn't really matter just as long as you can take a vertical video of your product so now your website is built you found the product you communicate with the supplier you're ready to go right it's looking great your your website's looking crisp and clean you're ready to go you're ready to launch you're excited right you're gonna take your product go back onto your TikTok account as well as your instagram account and you're gonna be posting three reels and three TikToks a day. Take videos of your product. It doesn't really matter where. 
just have good lighting, a good background, maybe something that's more eye-catching in the background if the product's not that eye-catching. Show the function of the product, show how it helps people, show how it works, show how it's cool, whatever you need. Usually you're gonna wanna caption it with either like a voiceover or that text to voice explaining what it is or keeping up with some trendy like trend that's going on, right? And you wanna post the exact same time, three times a day on both Instagram and TikTok. This creates consistency within the algorithm and helps promote your videos more. You're also gonna wanna use the proper hashtag. You want to not have these hashtags that are in the billions and billions of views because they're just gonna get overlooked. Everyone uses a hashtag, those hashtags, like hashtag for you page, don't use that, no. You wanna use hashtags that are actually specific to your product and specific to your niche so your account gets built in this algorithm and it's shown to the people that actually want this product or an interest in this niche. This is very crucial. It doesn't matter if your video gets a million views. If it's a million quality views, that's fantastic. If it's a million views from people that don't care about your product, waste of time. Following the recent trends is also really important. Go on your like TikTok's trending page and it tells you what trends are happening right now, like what people are watching, what people are doing, blah, 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 and copy those and implement them to your product with your own little twist on it. That's really helpful to get a lot of views as well. It goes viral in the category that you've been built into with your niche, which is exactly what you want. And so while you're doing this on both TikTok and Reels, make sure to engage with your followers and comments. So if they have questions, answer all of their questions. If they have DMs that they're saying to you wanting to collab, take up those offers because it is free advertising. If they just want you to send them a product, that's fine. Cover the product cost. But just make sure to engage in your community so you stay in that niche and the algorithm picks you up more. Now you've got some sales, you're rolling in and you're making some money. You say you've got 10 sales from TikTok. You're like, yes, let's go. Now you have to fulfill your orders. I recommend for the strategy of using $0 to start, fulfill your orders the next day, have your Shopify payout set up so that it pays you out every single day. So if you get 10 sales on Monday, you get paid for those sales on Tuesday. And then order your product to your customer on Tuesday with the money that you got paid from Shopify so you never have to spend any of your own money. If you have a high amount of orders, I do recommend using DSers. It's an app owned by AliExpress. It integrates really well and it allows you to order up to 100 orders at a time. Now you're gonna wanna rinse and repeat this. So continue to post three a day on Instagram and TikTok. I guarantee you, if your store looks nice, you have a nice product and you're posting three times a day on TikTok, you will get sales. Now everything that you've made for off of your zero or $30, you wanna reinvest into the business. So what I mean by this is starting to do paid ads so you can scale your business even higher and make more money. A lot of people get scared because when you pay for ads, you're taking a little bit bigger of a risk and you're taking a hit on your margin but I can tell you that you can scale a lot faster and a lot higher and even if your margin lowers a little bit you're still gonna make way more money than you were just doing organic traffic this is the exact strategy that I use when I built one of my stores and it worked for me and I wanted to relay this information to you because I know a lot of you guys want to start drop shipping with zero dollars so if this video is helpful please remember to subscribe remember to turn on the bell notifications as well if you like watching my videos really encourage you to leave a comment with critical feedback of my channel I would like to see what I could do better in how it could help you guys more and what kind of videos that you want to see other than that thanks for watching and get started on your dropshipping store today i know you've been thinking about it for months so just start it right now i guarantee you you'll thank me later all right you guys have a great day